Excalibur. It's the world's first autonomous, precision-guided artillery projectile, and it's proven so effective in the Iraq War that military commanders want more of them, lots more of them. With no in-flight guidance, conventional artillery shells have mostly been seen as area weapons. By contrast, Excalibur, which was developed by Raytheon Missile Systems, has GPS guidance built in. The 155 millimeter weapon is fired like a regular howitzer shell, but a receiver within the round acquires the GPS signal. Movable canard wings pop out and then steer it to the pre-programmed target with uncanny precision. And since it strikes near vertically, its impact minimizes collateral damage. The 100-pound Excalibur shell has three fuse settings, point detonation, proximity, and delay. When set on delay, the shell can penetrate up to eight inches of reinforced concrete. And since the canards deliver the round almost straight down onto the roof of a building, it can destroy the structure while containing the damage. Thus, Excalibur can be used in an urban setting and in close proximity to friendly troops. Army commanders say of the few shells fired in Iraq this past summer, most hit within 13 feet of targets up to 25 miles away. And shells that go wide can be made inert in flight. The U.S. Army is ramping up Excalibur production from the initial 18 to 100 rounds per month by year's end. The service's long-term requirement is for each Excalibur shell to cost no more than $39,000.